songs and traditions and culture and different types of music uh, from all over America, all over the United States, a little bit of everything, and we will uh, take you on that journey with us as we go. Let it go. 
beaucoup.
about what type of shoes I am wearing. These are actually just leather on the bottom. But um, the way tap dancing sort of started, um, and there's a lot, so there's jingle dancing uh, in Canada, and obviously um, Irish dancing has both soft shoe and hard shoe, and some of them now also have taps. But the way it started was you had regular shoes, and street performers wanted to be loud. And they took caps from beer bottles, and they started nailing them onto the bottom of their shoes so that they would get a louder sound. And that's how tap shoes kind of came to be. Tap shoes are way too loud when it's just me and Adrian, so I don't wear them. But these are surprisingly very loud, even though it's just heavy wood and leather on the bottom. And of course, when um, our hosts find us floors this good, it's easy for it to sound also very good, so thank you. But I'm gonna do a little bit of tap dancing for you because that is the first type of dancing that I really learned how to do.
in the blue. Polish-Americans. <laughs> you have to dance with us, okay? That is the one treat. We do one more song, we're gonna do a little treat. You have to dance with us. 